Look harder. Dude, it's not even a hill. <laughs> Five forty a.m. Saturday, fifteenth of May. And we're about to drive to Oxford to pick up our vet. Then we're going to Evesham for a time trial, and then we're going bike packing. Google's like acting up. This is like two different philosophies just kind of converging. <laughs> <laughs> what? Like fast time trial and then a really really slow. Yeah. <laughs> comfort. Yeah, comfort, bike packing, dude, 450, got, 500 kilometers. Dude, I've got, I still have 38 mil tires on my, on my, <laughs> on my bike. <laughs> nah. Time to hit it. 10 miles, the sun's coming out. Perfect. Should be good. Come on, son. Come on, Chris. Is that Chris? <laughs> we are indeed. <laughs> Come on, mate. Right, some faff later, it's nine o'clock. Uh, we found somewhere to park the car. We decided to come a bit further into Wales rather than staying in Hereford. Right, okay, so now we're not gonna ride on tonight. It's getting dark, it's wet. We haven't packed anything yet. We're gonna stay in this inn. So after the time trial yesterday, we thought we would drive to Hereford and cycle out from there, but we kind of thought we were running out of light and didn't want to set off in the dark, so we thought we'd drive a little further into Wales. So by the time we were all sorted, it would have been about 10 o'clock, and we thought, you know what, let's just stay in the hotel, have a beer, head out tomorrow. That's what we've done. We're on our way to Go check out some reservoirs, then go over to Abba, then we're heading up north to Snowdonia, about 180, 190 kilometers. Should be a good day. Honestly, can't recommend the Elan Valley enough. This is so, so gorgeous. I wish we'd managed to camp here. Can you imagine waking up to this? So good. over there, that's the bothy we, we thought about camping in. Yeah, you want to stay there tonight? <laughs> a 
I think it was a bit too much of a trek off road for the road bikes. But I think a gravel adventure up here, that would be an amazing place to stay. It would be so good. I can't complain. What, 30k to Lava? Yep. 25, 30k. Cool. We're in the forest somewhere. Had Hat for the state. Except cool. where it is. Yeah. And we're about to have a epic descent, which is very, very exciting. So we've just gone down a really, really lovely descent. We can't be too far off Abba now. I'm gonna go there, get some lunch, maybe get some supplies for dinner. And then, yeah, head on up towards Snowdonia. Look at those cars, bro. <laughs> Look at that. I never take this many stuff. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm definitely taking more, more content. Photos, more content. Yeah. I know you're more... calling it content now. Wait, I can get, can get a portrait. Which way are we going, dude? Of the rain, I got a bit cold and grumpy. But we soon fixed that with some hot drinks, some sweets. I've come up to this beautiful country. Wales is 
bring it here on the strip. Oh, it's glorious sunshine. Oh man, the sun on my face. It's so nice and warming. Right, so about 30, 35 kilometers away from Barmouth, where we are going to get some dinner and some supplies and then go find somewhere to camp and make the most of this glorious evening. Today has been such a gorgeous, amazing day. Some pretty chilly bits, some pretty wet bits, but in all, fine. We dodged the weather, most of it. This has been such an amazing route. I love Wales. And that's the rugby's on. over there and you can see that the rain is coming up the valley so it looks like we're gonna get there it'll probably be dark and we're gonna get wet Pizza is good, isn't it? It's the best pizza I've ever eaten. <laughs> I did not know they make the best pizza here in Bournemouth. A little, a little kebabby <laughs> in Barmouth. Yeah, this is the best pizza in I've North ever Wales in my life. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look at this. Like that. That's solid pizza. <laughs> and and no, like I'm glad you asked. It's not even stone baked. <laughs> <laughs> right. So we've been told there's some good camping spots up on the hill above Barmouth and we're now going off a path. The precarious drop to our left in the dark up onto the moors and apparently it's got a really good view of the whole bay which hopefully we should wake up to. Right, so we did about 100 miles today. It was pretty good fun. We were pretty lucky with the weather. And unlucky. And now I've got a little barbecue to warm our toes, a couple of beers, and we should wake up to an epic view of the entire bay. That's right. That's been a pretty good day and all, it's been, I reckon. It's been an epic day. Anyway, I think we're gonna chill out for a bit, hit the hay, and wake up at some point in the morning and do it all over again. Hello. See you guys. <laughs>